uh, was born in Kamloops, British Columbia. I grew up in a cabin for the first few years of my life with my dad on a small lake outside of town. I caught my first rainbow trout, I believe before I was two years old. Uh, he spent quite a few years in the hunting business and I spent a lot of years hunting with him. Um, when, when he sold the business, I was too young to have any friends that thoroughly enjoyed hunting and so the only option that I had really was to get back into fishing and I think I got my first fly rod that was my very own when I was maybe 14, 15 and um, it, it went from a, from a pastime to a full-blown obsession in about a week and I had a Honda CRX at the time, I was when I turned 17, I got my first car and I would load up my float tube and brought it into all sorts of lakes and, and um, basically fish for anything I could get my hands on. Uh, I joined the fly fishing industry when I was 17 with Trout Waters Fly and Tackle in Kelowna. Um, that was a huge head start for me. I kind of got to learn the, the ins and outs of the, of the industry and what, you know, the more the business side of things. and. Um, you know, it's, uh, I think that there's enough passion behind it that I don't know why or how I could ever leave it. Um, it's, you know, fly fishing has brought me to places all around the world. I mean, I, I wake up in the morning and, and the hamster wheel is turning and, and I, all I can think about, um, you know, is, is what's next. Um, eventually it, it became time to start my own venture, so I Founded Interior Fly Fishing Company out of Kamloops, BC. My wife and I moved back there uh, last spring, and um, it's incredibly rewarding. It's it's great to bring people to an area like this, bring people to places like Douglas Lake Ranch, bring people to all the lakes that we have in Region Three. Um, you know, and and it's fun to imagine furthering the venture with saltwater fishing. You know, some flats fishing and and. What not, but but it really comes down to you know just this wild obsession with with the sport of fly fishing that I don't think could you know I don't think that I could ever give it up for anything. I mean it's there's got to be something in my blood that's um, you know it's in, it's infectious and it's great to now be able to pass it along to other people and and while still being able to enjoy it for myself. Oh! That was sick.